Well, this morning I'm shooting a video of a brand new Kodiak. Uh, this is Kodiak Ultralight. And uh, this is a Dutchman product. A Dutchman Kodiak has been around for a long time. Uh, Dutchman offers a three year structural warranty. Uh, this Kodiak is 31 feet from the ball to the bumper. Uh, a lot of times when you see campers advertised, you know, this is a, this is a 26 RBSL. It is not 26 feet long. The box itself is about 27 foot and the overall length of the camper is 31. As you can see, this has a, a power tongue jack on the front, a full fiberglass cap on the front here with the uh, rock guard down below. It has LED lights in the, in the cap oversized baggage doors and they are magnetic uh, so your storage doors are very big one super slide on this unit and again this is a 2020 model so this is this is a brand new travel trailer this is one of our most popular floor plans 5700 pounds is the dry weight so this is half ton towable uh, we also brought this camper in with 50 amp service so you can put two air conditioners on this if you want to it already has the larger air conditioner so um, you know you can either get a 13.5 or a 15,000 we equip them uh, with the 15,000 BTU air uh, so that way uh, with this heat that we have down south it's definitely uh, appreciated by most uh, it's pre-wired for a backup camera, fully laminated construction. It's a full aluminum cage. Uh, this is a very, very well-built travel trailer. It's one of the best built travel trailers on the market as far as the construction of the box, uh, the chassis, the frame, uh, nice big power awning with an LED strip. Uh, you can see it has a little outside kitchen and you have a two burner gas uh, stove top little mini refrigerator some storage there is a light in there you have a 110 volt outlet and you can see this has the all season package it's a bare cage construction so it's a full aluminum cage um, the way that this thing is manufactured solid steps aluminum wheels outside speakers and just a really well-built lightweight travel trailer and it's excellent for two uh, it'll sleep up to four people it is uh prepped for a solar charger as well and you can see all the doors are magnetic and you can see the size of this storage box is huge it has led strip inside here as well as underneath the trailer here's your power stabilizer jacks uh, hit the button jacks go down and that'll stabilize the unit for you I'm gonna go ahead and take you inside, let you get a good look at it. And uh, like I said, this is a brand new one. It has all the current updates. Uh, you won't see a different one for 12 more months. So this is what they're gonna be building for the next year. And if you're looking for the latest, greatest thing, uh, maybe this is it. We'll go inside and let you look around. Okay, as we go inside, again, it's a 2020 uh, 261 RBSL. It does have a friction hinge door and as we walk in right to the left is your control board that's how you open your awning open your slide turn the lights on and to the right what you have is a a very big closet with motion lighting as you can see as we open that door the light came on and the general layout <coughs> of this trailer is uh, double reclining theater seat a huge u-shaped dinette um, again when you put that down that'll sleep two people and then I'll pan around and, and let you get a good look at it and you can see you can see right into the bedroom it has the oversized doors and again this is the new style you have a electric fireplace right here and this is where you'll put a television right across from your recliners. It has a larger refrigerator than uh, last year's model. So that is an eight cubic foot fridge. 
Uh, they updated the backsplash and stuff like that. Uh, it does have the three burner stove, uh, the Furion uh, oven, and this is uh, a new feature as well. It has the uh, farmhouse sink, they call it, a nice stainless steel sink. And you have storage, and it, all solid wood cabinets in here also. So all your drawers and cabinet doors are all solid wood. Uh, excellent uh, ceiling height and a slide out. And then this is a, I want to say that's a 32 inch uh, wide door right there. And it is a wooden pocket door that slides across. And your bedroom, you have a 60 by 80 queen size bed. And of course you have cabinets on both sides of the bed for hanging wardrobe. And you definitely have room to get around the bed, as you can see. And again, this is a 50 amp service. So we can add a second air conditioner here if you think you need it. Right now it's about 60 degrees in this trailer. And we got the air conditioning going. And it's, uh, but it's not one of them 110 degree days either. So uh, thankfully. This is where you would hang a second television right here. And I'm gonna go ahead and uh, show you the, the main feature of this. Again, it's 31 feet from the ball to the bumper. It is uh, 5,700 pounds. Very, very well built trailer. And the RBSL, again, theater seating across from your TV. And then as we go into the back here, uh, the back of the trailer is all restroom and you have a nice corner shower linen closets here and then you can see you have a nice medicine cabinet and that's also a new feature where they put the lights uh, behind the medicine cabinet as you can see and motion lighting as well and then you have a big wall of storage right here you got a couple drawers uh, three big cabinets that are pretty deep and it's just really really nice and the shower is a nice size shower I said you have the glass uh, the glass doors nice corner shower uh, plenty of sailing height in this trailer uh, I'm six foot three uh, I would have no problems taking a shower or moving around not worried about banging my head or anything like that but this is a really nice couples coach uh, if you're looking for a newer trailer for uh, you and the wife or you and the husband uh, whoever's looking at this video uh, give us a try and if this is not what you're looking for take a look at nicecampers.com and maybe we'll have something up there that you do like and like always I appreciate you watching my videos and have yourselves a uh, great day